Hey folks, it's Laura with Rain Tree Nursery. And I have the privilege today of sitting underneath a mini dwarf Bardsey Island apple tree. This adorable tree is part of a tradition of apples that have been cultivated on Bardsey Island, which is on the west coast of Wales, for over a thousand years in monastery gardens. You really are eating a piece of history when you grow and eat this apple. It's really an adorable tree, very, very durable, and it's one of those lovely introductions that we get to make here at Rain Tree Nursery. We were the first to introduce this apple into the United States several decades ago. So to still be growing after over a thousand years on a remote island, you'd have to be a pretty tough apple. And Bardsey is that. It is hardy down to USDA Zone 5. It is scab and canker resistant, which makes it easy to grow organically. It's considered a very good keeper for an early apple, and it does ripen fairly early in September here in the Pacific Northwest. It's also an early bloomer, bloom category two, so it will pollinate with anything that's very early in blooms groups one, two, or three, so early to mid-season bloom. Look at these lovely little small to medium sized apples. The tree is very prolific considering how small it is on this mini dwarf rootstock. Mm. Oh, and it's got this adorable little pink blush on the inside. <laughs> My goodness. It's tasty. It's sweet tart. It's got a nice tender flesh, but it's firm. If you get to take a trip to Bardsey, I'd say you should go. It's Laura with Rain Tree Nursery. See you next time.